Hey guys, welcome to this video. Our topic is the soil composition and the uh, properties. Mainly, uh, the main topic is the soil. So in this video, we'll discuss with the soil composition and the properties. Let's start with the soil composition. Now, soil you have to know is a complex substance that is composed of five major components. Namely, the first one is the mineral matter. Uh, these are uh, inorganic particles. They are obtained by the disintegration and the decomposition of rocks. Uh, we already discussed the decomposition and the disintegration of rocks. That is uh, weathering. You can you refer to my alpha video? Now, the second one is that the organic matter, these are obtained by the decaying of the plant residues, uh, uh, animal remains, and the microbiota tissues. The other components are uh, water. That is also, you can say, moisture obtained from the atmosphere and the reactions of the of the soil, which can be chemical, physical, or micro microbial. So all these reactions uh, and the from the atmosphere, so we're obtaining the amount of water or moisture. The other component air or gases that are from also the atmosphere reactions with the roots microbes and the chemicals in the soil. The last one are the living organisms. Example, the microorganisms, uh, such as the microbes or worms, et cetera, et cetera. So all these are the components that compose the soil. Now, uh, we'll discuss each one of them in detail. Now, we have to note that the, the typical soil consists of uh, approximately the 5% of mineral, 5% organic matter, 25% water and the 25% air and the less than 0 0.5, 0 0.1% living organisms by volume. Now, in reality, the soil basically it is very complex and dynamic. Since the composition of soil can be fluctuated on the daily basis, depending on the numerous factors, we've already seen some of the factors that can lead to the soil formation but they can be other factors such as the amount of water supply, cultivation practices, uh, or soil type. So these are just numerous factors that can lead to the fluctuation of the composition of the soil. Now, here's this illustration of soil composition uh, shown in the pie chart. As we've said, that it, this, is a, this is the typical uh, position of soil say the mineral matter of 5%. So that's the greater amount of what uh, soil is composed of. It is mainly composed of the mineral matter. Then it comes to water, that is 25%. Then air, 25%. Uh, then the organic matter, uh, that could be 5%. And the less than 0.1% of uh, living organisms, uh, for example, the microorganisms. So that's all for this video. I hope it's clear we've introduced the various components of uh, that forms the soil. So the main components of the soil, and we we'll later on discuss them in detail uh, one by one. We said that there are five of them. So we dive more deeper into each one of them in our next videos.